swala la usalama katika kaunti ya Laikipia limeshughulikiwa na hiyo maneno ya wizi na mauaji itafika mwisho na mimi ningetaka nichukue nafasi kuwapongeza county commissioner wetu na katika police commander na wale kamati zetu sote za usalama kwa kazi nzuri ambayo mumefanya asanteni sana lakini kugali kumebaki 30% tugali tuko na maafa hapo tuko na hapo wizi wa ngombe na area hiyo na area zingine na mimi ningetaka niseme nikiwa hapa leo ya kwamba tutafanya kila juhudi hiyo asilimia 30 imebaki Dio watu ya laikipia waweze kulala usingizi wa muke ya asubuhi kama wakenya wengine bila mlio ya risasi bila wizi ya ngombe bila ya mtu yote kushutishwa hiyo 30% utashughulikia na mimi ningetaka county commissioner na watu yako you must work around the clock and these chiefs must help you because they know where the problems are i know we have an an upsurge from the neighboring tiati from baringo east ambao wanakuja kusumbua sisi hapa katika laikipia kaa chini bwana county commissioner na mimi ningetaka tuseme ya kwamba ile mpango tumefanya katika north rift ya kuweka askari ya jeshi na wale ya polisi au maaramia watu wanatusumbua walikuwa nafikiria ni mchezo kwa sababu hapo mbeleni askari walikuwa anamwagwa kuna kuwa na operation mwezi tatu mwezi ina wanaondoka wale bandits wanarudi ningetaka niseme nikiwa hapa laikipia hao wanajeshi tumemwaga katika area hizo hao polisi watakaa hapo mwaka huu wa 2023 watakuwa huko 2024 watakuwa huko 2025 watakuwa huko 2026 wataishi huko milele mpaka hii maneno yishi na tuna haraka ya kupeleka hao anywhere they will stay there hakuna pahali wataenda sasa wewe kama ulikuwa kazi yako ni kutafuta pesa wizi ya ngombe utafuta kibarua kingine ya kufanya kama mlikuwa mnafikiria tu askari wataondoka they are going nowhere they will stay and tunasema the government to deal with insecurity in Laikipia and in North Rift conclusively and decisively once and for all is a government led by president william samuel ruto hiyo ndio serikali tamaliza hiyo maneno and we are determined our cs for interior kithure kendiki has come to that region for six months and he'll continue camping there until we restore law and order and we bring to an end insecurity so that kenyans can enjoy their constitutional right of life and safety for their property governor mumeomba tuongeze nyinyi national police eh, npr si ndio sasa lazima tukae utuambie how many you are willing kusaidia unajua tutasaidiana tulikubaliana gavana sisi tuko na askari na buduki na wiko na pesa si ni mpango tuelewane si mpigie governor makofi yeah. so governor you come you tell us how many we will give you the number you want yeah Aska, watu siiko Buduki iko na risasi iko. Siwe iko na pesa. Iko shida gani? Kuna shida? So acha governor akuje huyu wakaora ni mtu wetu. Eh? Na watu ya Laikipia ni mpogeze nyinyi kuchagua huyu jamaa. Mujipigie makofi. Pale mbele mlikuwa mmepotea mume mkachagua mtu mwingine ya kusubua watu. Saa hii anatembea na sufuria kwa kichwa alikuwa governor. Si mlikuwa mmeanguka watu ya Laikipia. Lakini kwetu tunasema kuteleza sio nini? na kufanya makosa sio mbaya baya ni nini kaa chini governor you know sometime mkienda uchaguzi this governor called Joshua Irungu alifanyia nyinyi kazi mingi lakini kwa sababu ni mpole na apigi kelele mkaona ati mtavuta mtu ya kupiga kelele na maringo na madoido ati jina kubwa ya familia kubwa nini mkakuja mkaweka mkienda kutafuta huyu mlikuwa mnalia na jicho moja mmefungua ingine sasa nyinyi mkae na huyu gavana. Na huyu gavana anatusaidia sana kwa sababu he works together with the national government. Ndio watu ya like you And that is why we are supporting him. 
and governor will work with you, look for resources to give uh, the allowances to the NPRs, will give you the NPRs to help you and the people of Laikipia to secure this county so that people can go about their lives. Kwa hivyo na kushukuru sana. Pia na shukuru nyinyi kwa kumrudisha huyu senator, huyu ya Jacobo na Ibrahimu na wale wengine. Huyu sasa yule walikuwa na shidana na yeye ndio wanatumiwa na Raila kuenda kuchoma vitu huko Kitengela. Hiyo vijana walienda kuchoma Kitengela ni waile kikudi ya hiyo mtu mlikuwa mnaambiwa mchagua hapa senator. Ndio amelipwa pesa na Raila kutafuta vijana ya hiyo kikudi haramu kwenda kuchoma mali ya watu huko Mlolongo huko Mombasa Road ati ni kiongozi ati wa kikuyu. Sasa kwani watu wanadharau hiyo kikuyu kiasi gani? Huyu anaweza kuwa kiongozi wa kikuyu. Na mlaletewa hapa laiki pia timumchague. Sasa amekuwa dio muti ya kukodishwa na watu ya azimio. Those boys who are looting things on Mombasa Road belong to that Kebinongang. We are going to hunt them down. Kazi ka chini center. And let me say now pahali imefika. Sasa ni sawa. It's okay. Sasa wacha sasa tuone vile itakuwa. Sisi ni tunapenda demokrasia, we respect human rights, we respect the constitution. Bado kuna serikali yoyote responsible itakubali watu kufanya ile maneno tuliona jana Nairobi. Wewe unasema tunafanya maandamano kuuliza haki yako. Hii mambo ya kuharibu mali ya watu sasa hiyo ni haki gani wewe unatafuta? What right are you fighting for? Destroying life watu wamekufa watu saba jana juzi wamekufa watu sita atuona jiita kiongozi and that is why we told uhuru kinyata on his face as we chagua hiyo mtu hiyo mtu tunamjua that is a lot of violence and impunity in the republic of kenya and i personally told uhuru kinyata my friend and i was his personal assistant nikamwambia hiyo mtu za tuletea hatuwezi chagua this is a violent man hii ni mtu ya kuchafua nchi ni mtu ya kufanya mauaji. Alianza hii maneno 1982 akibidua rais Moi. Akauua watu. 1997 akauua watu. 2007 akafanya watu wa uawe. Alafu uhuru alikuwa anatuambia tumchague tukamwambia akwende. Tukakataa uhuru na mtu yake. Sasa wameshikana mauaji imeanza. Last Monday they killed six people. Jana watu saba. Sasa nimeona anasema atatakuwa Monday Tuesday na Wednesday. Wanataka kuua watu gapi kila siku? Ni watosheke. Hii damu ya Wakenya wanataka ni ya nini? How much blood must you shed Raila Odinga for you to be satisfied? The people of Kenya rejected you five times. Wamekukataa Wakenya. You are now eight years. What are you fighting for? Ni nini unafanya? Ati unapanga kila siku watu na wawa, kila siku watu na wawa mali ya watu inaharibiwa we hakuna kazi unafanya watu yako hakuna kazi wanafanya umechukua vijana wetu wa hiyo krimino gang inaongozwa na hiyo mtu hapa like pia unawatumia na walipa pesa kidogo and we are asking we are asking mimi nimemwambia uru kenyata i told president uru kenyata this man unatuletea huyu is a problem of this country and this country shida yake itaisha tukimalizana na hiyo mtu so watu wamekufa watu saba jana mande walikufa sasa hao wako na mabibi wako na watoto what with their parents sasa hao watoto wamewachwa yatima watasema ni nini what is it so mimi nataka kupongeza watu ya lekipia tafadhali muweke amani muweke amani niliona hiyo vijana hiyo kikudi hapo nyanyuki wanaruka ruka pale nya uhuru juzi wamefukuza hiyo ndirito muridhi wewe ulishindwa kufanya kazi kama gavana ukafukuzwa na watu ya Laikipia sasa wanakuja kuwaletea maandamano you had an opportunity to serve the people of Laikipia for five years you failed wakakufukuza si mlifukuza hii mtu si ninyi mlimfukuza sasa analetea nyinyi maandamano hapo mfanyie nini analetea nyinyi Raila Odinga kuja kuchafua amani Laikipia au au Bwana Dirito Muridi how ungrateful can you be to the people of Laikipia 
They gave you five years as governor, you failed to work. Wewe kusema asanti ni kuletea au maandamano na kuchafua amani katika Laikipia. Why can't you tell the people of Laikipia, thank you for giving you five years. Wale kupatia na fazi ukashiru na kazi. Sasa umerudi hapa kuja kuleta vijana ya kudi haramu kuchafua amani katika Laikipia. Laikipia already we have a problem of insecurity about it. Wewe wanakuja kuongeza maneno ingine hapa ya kukoroka watu ya Laikipia. I'm going to call a meeting for the leaders of this region and Mount Kenya region to make a decision on how to deal with these characters now. This region, akuna mutu atakubaliwa kuja katika region hii kuchavua amani. Yeah. Mukita kuchavua amani, muchavue kwenu. Sisi katika Mount Kenya, we have never known hiyo ujinga ya kuwawa watu na kuharibu mali. It has never happened in this region. Sasa wewe dirito muridi, wewe kioni, wewe bairia, muna ndaganyo na raila, muna kuja kuchafua amani hapa katika mulima Kenya. Watu ya mulima Kenya ni watu ya bidi, ni watu ya biyashara, ni wakulima. Hawajui mamba ya kuharibu mali. Watu ya hapa ni watu ya kutafuta mali na kuchunga mali. Kweli ya mawongo? Sasa nyinyi muna tumiwa na huyu kibaraka wenu kuja kuchafua amani katika area hii. I'm going to call a meeting for leaders. We are going to make a decision as a region so that we agree what will happen. But this region, kama mutu nataka kuharibu pahali ingine, not this one. This one, no, it will not happen. So see, we have a challenge as a region, ya pombe. Tuko na challenge ya pombe, na banki. Tuko na challenge ya matuna. Tunajaribu kuokoa watoto wetu kwa mambo ya pombe na banki. Nyinyi watu ya azimio mukija hapa munatebea na wajakoya, yule anasema banki, watu wakuze na, wakunyu, na watumie. Rafiki yenu, yule mkubwa ni wajakoya. Yule mutu ya kusema watu wafanya nini? Watumie banki. Shida yetu katika region hii ni banki. You cannot be for this community. You are against this community. As a region, we have a challenge with the drugs, with the banki. And we are trying to work with our security officers, with the leaders, with the church, to deal with the problem of illicit bruise and drug abuse in this region. Then the guy you walk around with is the one telling our children that banki is a good thing. They should grow it and they should be allowed to use bank. And then you say you are a leader from this community. Lakini yata mimi najua ni kuwa najiuliza, how come watu wazima wako na akiri na wamesoma? Wanaweza faa sufuria kwa kichwa. Lakini saida niyona watabea na wajakoya ni kahelewa. You know? You know? Eh? Mchera na mkuhuduri. Eh? Eh. The company you keep tells who you are. If you walk around with a fellow who smokes banki and who is championing for banki to be sold openly, to be legalized, what is likely to happen to you? And what is your behavior now showing? I want to say we are going to make a decision and quickly because uh, this is unacceptable and uh, no 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 pana pana no no it's not possible to ask kubali it's not possible kwa hivyo mimi sitaki kusema kuzidi hapo nataka kuomba nyinyi tuendelee na kufanya kazi na tuendelee kuweka amani na tufuate sheria za jamhuri ya Kenya hii nchi ya sheria na kuna sheria imekubalia mtu mwingine kuharibu mali ya mkenya mwingine ama kumuumiza. Na nitseme ya kwamba officers wetu please wana county commissioner wana police commander don't allow under whatever circumstance the resurgence of that criminal gang here in Lake Don't.
Yeah. Na mimi I want to say that any security officer in this region who allow the resurgence of that gang it's up to you. We cannot allow that gang to resurge here. They, we know what they did to our women. We know what they did to our children. We know what they did to our businessmen. That criminal gang will not be allowed to be revived. Not just in Laikipia, but in the Republic of Kenya. Please sit down. Kwa hivyo mimi nimeshukuru. Iko macheki muko nayo sasa tupeane. Sasa unajua karibu tunakula mori kidogo hii watu wanatukasirisha. Ya kuharibu mali ya watu. Alafu waziri wetu huyu Rebecca Mwana wewe Rebecca kuja hapa watu wakuone. Sasa linduri utaki watu wasikie sauti ya hii mrembo. Huyu waziri wetu ni mzuri sana na ndio ametusaidia mambo ya chakula kila siku hapa Laikipia. Leo ametumia sisi gunia 800 